come in. Today we're talking about composition and discussing centers of interest. If you haven't seen the video on the rule of thirds already, do that first. Recognize what your eye is most drawn to in a scene and register this as a center of interest. In this image, my eye is drawn to this house. But it's positioned in a very hard horizontal line which divides the image in two. And I don't want that to be the case. But all is not lost. Find yourself a piece of tracing paper and put four lines on this which will divide the piece equally into nine sections. So we now have our rule of thirds on a piece of tracing paper. The house has ended up right in the middle, which we know we don't want. So what we do to reposition it is slip the tracing paper to give us a new position. Try it in different places so that you get a different idea of how this house might be able to look in the same scene, just framed differently. And I think on the whole, I prefer this. So I'm going to take it just a little below that cross here there, and I'm going to set it down and bring over my L. I've made a paper L so that I can frame this and remove the bits of the image I don't want. And these bits, which are extended and of course have nothing behind them, can be invented very similarly down there and a continuation of these lines over there. That's the end of the video on centres of interest. For more hints and tips, subscribe or go to my website effigallatly.co.uk where you can purchase my book, Patterns in Landscape. See you soon.